Okay, so now that we have the JDK good to go, we're gonna download something very powerful, and that is the IntelliJ IDE. IDE means Integrated Development Environment, and that's basically a text editor as you know it, but much more sophisticated. So for example, it allows you to write in various programming languages and gives you all kinds of support to write more productively. It has version control integrated and gives you syntax highlighting to make the code more readable, all that kind of good stuff. So let's go ahead and download this IDE. So to do that, we're gonna go to the jetbrains.com website. Again, I'm gonna post the URL in the course materials, so you can just click on it if you want. And once you're on the site, you're gonna go right here to IDEs, click on IntelliJ IDEA, the most intelligent Java IDE, which also contains Kotlin. And next, we're gonna go down here to download, click on download, that's the, that's completely free. So that's the community edition that JetBrains offers that has not all the features of the paid version, but more than enough for us. So we're gonna click on download right here. It's gonna take us down here and we want the community edition. So we're gonna scroll down and if you're on a different operating system, this is gonna select the right one for you right away. So then you can just click on download, click on save file. And then once the download has finished, again, the same thing, you're gonna be guided through the whole installation and just follow through it, decide which directory to install it to, and that's all you need to do. And it's probably gonna start JetBrains right away after the installation. So see you in the next lecture where we're gonna take a look at the IntelliJ IDE.